Heroes have different attributes. Picking infantry would give you more health but less attack. While picking hunter would give you more attack but less health. I would prefer if you go with hunter. When it comes to attacking a monster, you need to watch out for his health and attack. If your attack is more than his health, you will one-shot him. And if your defense is more than his attack, you will barely take any damage. Some monsters come with skills that could make them avoid damage from you or deal extra damage to you so be careful. I prefer if you always keep the health packs on the end as it heals based on how much health you are missing. Dice provides you with skill cards that improve your journey and make it easier. I would prefer if you pick a card that increases the chance of stunning the enemy or life stealing, but not improving the intensity of the effect. You may find an Easter Egg Monster. The Easter Egg Monster has to be killed as soon as possible. You may come across a dungeon once in a while. Those monsters inside the dungeon can be hard, so watch out for the exploding type as it explode dealing damage to you but it still stuns the nearby enemies too, so kill those enemies first as any stunned enemy won't be able to hit back and deal damage to you. On the last floor of every level you will face a boss monster with special skills. Don't be afraid to use all of your saved up skills because it doesn't carry over to the next mission. Gift missions have no monsters and only rewards. They come to every 20 floors according to the game. Some infected come with bone armor. This bone armor absorbs most of your first attack no matter how strong it is, which is why we consider upgrading defense to lower the impact on the later levels. Life Leech is an extremely good card. It has a chance to recover back your health at a percentage of your damage, so consider taking it. You can reset the floor as much as you want, and it won't cost you a ticket, however, if you abandon the floor you will lose the ticket. You can use that to your advantage to get better cards. Do you see that son of a cat infected? This dude attacks from far and you need to reach out to him before he spanks you. So you could reset the mission as many times, so he could spawn closer to you so you could deal with him easier. You can however use stun bombs or nukes to show the map and kill him. Trust me he is pain on the ass and deserves the bomb. The best upgrade on the excavation is the hero seat. It boosts your stats massively as it allows you to add an extra hero. However don't forget to upgrade the engine as it unlocks two important upgrades the armor which allows you to take less damage, and the drill which allows you to progress further. If you find this video useful please consider like and subscribe as it provides me with food for my 5 children.